Hi guys, <laughs> welcome back to the channel. Another Saturday, another shave. How's everybody doing? Uh, feeling good, feeling strong. Good week at work. Now we're at the weekend. Gonna round it off with a good time. I'm gonna get started off with a good shave. And I'm quite excited. I've got some new products in the den today. Um, and I will start off telling you about them first. The soap that we're going to be using. Um, I bought this about oh, a month ago and I put it away and I, at the same time as I bought it I bought some sterlings and I bought some uh, PAAs and so on uh, and this kind of got pushed to the back of the queue and then I, I am CDB and Shave 326 Klitschko Ken I saw them both using it uh, and I got jealous and I thought oh I'm gonna use it then <laughs> so uh, there you go and eat you I think it means friends in Italian. So, um, ciao, Matteo Robado, amici. Yeah, uh, Matteo, how are you doing? Okay, that's Matteo Robado, he's a head shaver in Italy. If you don't like the head shaving videos, go check his channel out. Good guy, good shaves. So that's what we're gonna be using. The scent profile on this now. <clears throat> I get, do you know at Christmas when you get little pieces of fruit, covered in sugar, like crystallised jellies or something they're called. Well, the orange one of those, that's what that smells like to me. Orange crystallised fruit with the slightest hint of pepper. I'm going to put that there. The thing I'm most excited about is new in the den today, other than that, and it's this little bad boy. Check that out. And that is been after this for a long long time that is a parker variant uh very similar to the Kurt progress which is my number one all time absolute love it for performance style feel looks shaves everything uh, you can't beat that just cannot beat that progress at all for me uh, and everyone says this just inches it against the progress so i'll be interested to see that but that's it, that's the um, Parker variant, got one at last, and that's the hardware we're going to be using. And what I'm going to be putting in, I couldn't think of a razor blade that I would put in. And then I had a bit of a light bulb moment, and thought we would go with the Edison. Light bulb, see that, Ed Edison. Right, anyway, so there you go. There it is, the blade, can you see it? Edison stainless Now, I don't know if you can notice this. I don't know if anyone can tell me this It says one and three on there. Can you see that? And then at the bottom it says two and four Those have no idea what those numbers are for But anyway, that's an Edison and I'll show you the rest of the stuff and then we'll put this blade in that Parker variant the brush I'm going to be using i used it for a while, I thought while we're going with Italian, we'll go with Fines 22mm synthetic. Look at that, isn't that just a stunning colour? And a, a beautiful little blue brush, absolutely love this brush. There you go, we'll stick that in there to soak. Um, the aftershave. Now guys, I've only used this once before and it's good stuff. But it, it still, it, it still um, amazes me when I use it and see it. Yeah, look at this. It's aftershave gel, and it is a. It's an aftershave, and it's in gel. Look, it looks like hand sanitizer or something, doesn't it? And that's aloe vera based aftershave gel. Uh, and we're gonna, we're gonna be, we'll use some of that aftershave, yeah, and later on keep some of that moisture. We're gonna get some of that rock face. Just moisture, it's not aftershave balm that all weather moisturizer for sensitive skin. We'll put some of that moisture back in the skin. Oh, sorry guys, sweating again. Uh, right, let's uh, let's crack on with this. You see there, like I'm the, the copy and the progress, they got the notch there and the notch there, and you have to match the two notches up. If you were to take that top cap off, put your blade in, then turn it around and put it back. It would mess up the alignment at the bottom there. So you've got to make sure 
here's the thing here's what you do with this guys with the progress you just turn it and that comes loose with this it's slightly different if watch you turn it you could keep turning it and then you can see it ah just there just at that point there it, it disengages you see that so i don't know if that's a it's disengaged now uh, and then you unscrew and the top cap comes off so what we'll do is we'll get that edison blade in there i think that edison was a gift from the dc shaves go and check his channel out so let's check out fire up the notches where we're we going notch there notch there so you one in that end cap there matches the one in that end cap there so what you do is you do you let's have a look you see that's caught it screwing it bang right right now you just screw it all the way around you see there's like a little notch there i don't know like a little hole can you see it and there's numbers on here so you would just screw that all the way up until you see the the plus sign okay, the plus sign is right under the notch you see it right now to adjust it now that's its mildest setting you dial it back all the way then you've got there it's on two two and a half three three and a half four four and a half all the way up to five the most aggressive setting there you go and i think what we'll do is we'll do five three and a one so we'll put that in the water oh right just have to wipe my face so what i'm gonna crack open the door again oh what it is guys i've got a kidney infection i mean this month i'll be so glad when this month's gone and i'm on antibiotics and one of the one of the things they do the two things they do is they make you breathless uh, and they give you spikes in temperature and they also make you feel sick i've had that as well but um yeah that's a spike in temperature because getting a bit flushed but hey enough i'm feeling good i'm looking forward to the weekend i'm back these tablets finish in a couple of days and then it's pew, full steam ahead for john okay so without further ado i think this is the latest i've ever started a shave in a video isn't it we'll crack on wet this face oh yes and then we'll get this shave done here we go amici first time use yeah, let's get it i'll just go straight from the pool hey people think it's too wet it's too wet it don't matter all you're doing is loading a thick paste a top layer oh yeah oh yeah certainly getting that that dried crystallized fruit scent from it now uh, don't be scared press down a bit if you have to not too hard but basically you're loading the brush oh, yeah. i know i know you all know this but i just want to i don't want any dead air in the videos you know not talking so what do you reckon guys do you reckon we're there we'll go with that so we'll put that on there out of the way here we go let's crack on Oh yeah, do you know, this brush, to say it's only a little 22, but I'm not fond of the smaller brushes. But it's like I've always said, fines don't make a bad product of it. Regardless of what it is, they do not make a bad product in this brush. Absolutely fantastic. I'll put a bit of, I'll get a bit of water in them. So, How's everybody's week been? I've not had the greatest week then, but I can feel myself getting better. The infection's going. Um, my, my, oh, we had a hard week at work. Um, but that was, that was a good thing. It was positive because it was very hard and very physically demanding. Uh, and I just flew through it. Brilliant. Absolutely flew through it. No, no issues, no worries. I felt good. 
I felt strong, so I'm back. Okay, here we go. Parker variant, first use ever on this channel. It's a heavy, head heavy. I mean, look, look, where's the balance? Look, it, it, it's yeah, it, it's a heavy beast. I'm looking forward to using it. Most aggressive setting, number five. good yeah well that's very good that guys that's very good now I'll reserve judgment for now but I'm ultimately going to compare it to the progress and I know I've not used the progress much on my videos but before I started filming videos, uh, about up until about three years ago, but the progress was one of my only razors. And because it was a gift and because I loved it so much, it, it was all I used for a long, long time. So I've got the number of the progress. Um, whether it's because of whether it's because of sentimentality. Or whether it's just true, I can only go with what I feel. And I can tell you right now, this is a superb piece of kit and well worth the money, uh, but it's not progress. Not for me. For the progress just, it just cuts that, oh man. It just cuts that bit better, you know, but I'll be honest with you. I'm kind of on the Paul H school of thought when it comes to comparing razors. I tend that that is very to me, that is very, very clearly a take on the progress. But I'd rather not compare them. I would just rather judge that as a pack of Arium. And the progress is a progress. I wouldn't compare the two because the two different razors by two different manufacturers. I know you compare things all the time, but I'm not fond of I'm not fond of, of comparing in, in that regard. So I would say it's it's equal to the progress as regards what it is. But if you were to do a direct comparison, I can tell you right now, for me, that's no progress. But I mean, oh yeah, look at that guys. It's took it down though, hasn't it? I would certainly buy it. I think I paid 49 pounds for it. And it got shipped free. Here's another thing. They said to me, um, would you like uh, two day shipping, which will be something like four pounds. Or would you like next day shipping, which will be eight pounds. Or do you just want free shipping and we'll get it to you in, in two weeks? And I click free shipping and it came the day after. Mm -hmm. So so there you go. So I even managed to get a bag of bargain and that, that resulted in that. So anyway, right, okay, we'll dial it down now, guys. See the little hole type thing there? Can you see? I don't know if you can see that it's on five. And we'll take it down now. And that's on three. Here we go. Wow, you can definitely feel. You definitely and this is you definitely feel a drop in aggression here. No. Yeah, no, that, that feels very smooth, but I'll tell you what. This isn't. This can't touch the progress, guys. Cannot touch it. For me, number three on a progress is number five on this. Yeah, superb razor. Very smooth, this. Very smooth. I'd buy it again. 
I'd certainly recommend it if you were thinking of getting one. I would certainly have got my recommendation. But for me, as I stand here right now, if I had the money and I had the choice, without any shadow of a doubt, it would be a progress for me. I would, if I had to, if I was going to buy one of them, and they're both, I think the progress is about ten pounds dearer than this, maybe a fiver. On some websites, it may even be the same. But knowing what I know now, if I went on a website and they had one that and a progress side by side for the same price, I would get the progress. I would. Put there. Yeah. Let's tuck it down, guys. Right, what we're gonna do now? I'm gonna revisit that. Hook a little. Here we go. See where we go. Oh yeah. Mmm, smells fantastic. So, how's everybody doing? Have you all had a good week? I'm just excited. I think this is the best. As I stand here now making this video. This is the best I've felt in well over a month. So you wake up and you're like, yes, at last, you know. Um, yeah. So how's everybody doing? What are your shaves of the day? What do you think of this? Have you got one? What do you think? Let me know. If you're out there watching this video and you've got one of these in a progress, let me know what you thought of them. But, uh, oh yeah, yeah, it's a quality instrument, guys. No doubt about it. But then again, I think it's Indian, if I'm not mistaken, I think Parker are Indian. And I've said this on quite a few of my videos, when it comes to shaving stuff. As a general rule of thumb, anything out of India is pretty good, isn't it? It really is. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what, guys, it's very smooth. Um... It feels good in the hand. It's it's heavier than the progress, I think. Um, <laughs> yeah, it bends the blade like the progress, but I think the progress bends it a little better, a little. Yeah. Yeah. That, uh, yeah, I think the settings are different. I do. I think the settings are different. I think the aggression levels are different. This is a very smooth quality blade, guys. Um, if there was no such thing as a progress, and I only had to have one razor for life, I could see me picking this one. I really could. Yeah. Very close. Very smooth. Pick up time. A lot of mittens there. Yeah. Yeah. Just the usual suspects, guys. I always struggle. I said I would dial it down, didn't I? Come on, let's dial it down then. We'll go back now. Yeah, we'll do one for the pickups. Yeah. Very good. Very smooth razor. Like I said, huh? I don't know if it's sentimentality or... Uh, or it's just because I had that one first. But for me, the progress pips it. Okay. Oh, there you go. I'll get those off. So please click like and subscribe, guys. Thank you for watching. Hope you're all having a, a nice weekend and a good week too. 
Uh, thanks for all the comments. I love the car, I love the likes uh, and the watches and everything. And please subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Uh, I'd appreciate your subscription. Okay, here we go. Look at this. There's some of this aloe vera gel after shave. Are you watching? <laughs> Look at that, guys. It's all right, you know. <laughs> Oh yeah, oh very fresh, oh it smells like Thayer's Cucumber <laughs> Witch Hazel, so I don't know if there's cucumber in it but yeah, beautiful, very slick, very you can feel it hydrating the skin, you really can, so it's going to go well, I've already tested it in the bedroom on the back of my hand uh, and the scent profile goes very well with this rock face moisturising so we'll put some moisture I'm not going to use a lot oh and then what I'm off now I'm going to go make myself a lovely pot of fresh coffee we bought some freshly ground coffee my daughter went into town uh, last week and there was a shop there and they were selling freshly ground uh, dark chocolate scented coffee and I'm going to have a cup of that and some wholemeal toast and upload this video so brilliant absolutely brilliant look at this what do you reckon guys good shave today eh good shave thanks for watching uh, it feels good to be back it really does we're getting there aren't we have a fantastic weekend everybody um, and I will see you next week for the midweek shave and something new in the den. <laughs> Bye.